In this video, I will show you how to transfer a WordPress blog from one host to another. Have you ever needed to move a WordPress blog? I recently decided to consolidate my hosting. I had reasons for different hosts in days gone by, but now they're not applicable. So now I have mainly personal blogs for my children and myself that need to be moved. Here is a rundown of what it takes to move your WordPress site. Number one, get a backup of the site and export the database. Two, change name servers at the domain registration site. Three, add the domain to the new hosting account in cPanel. Four, create new installation of WordPress. Five, copy files from backup. Now all of this can take a lot of time, but I'm going to share with you my secret weapon. It is WP Twin, a great time-saving tool created by Jason Fladlian and Wilson Matos. It is not only great in this situation, but also for backing up your WordPress site. I will demonstrate what I did to move my sites using WP Twin. So I went to the website estertravelsavings.com and typed in wptwin.php. That was after having loaded the plugin to the website. And then this page comes up and you click on the click to clone. Also tick the include non-WordPress folders to get images etc copied across. Okay, now it had created the clone and then I right click to download and saved it to a directory on my computer. So then after that we moved on to the domain registrar. So in this one I'm showing you how you change the name service for an account in GoDaddy. So you click on the domain management and select the domain you wish to change, set name servers. This box opens up and you click on edit and then enter in the appropriate name servers which you should have from your hosting provider. So that's done. Now I'm showing you how it's done in Namecheap. So you click on the domain, then domain name setup, enter the appropriate information and then click on save. So that's changing the name servers. It's all done, saving changes. After that, you head over to the cPanel. And once you're in cPanel, you will scroll down and look for add-on domains. Once you see that, you click on add-on domains enter the domain you're adding to this hosting account, put in a password and click on add domain. So that now associates this domain with this hosting account. So there you go, it says it's been created. Okay, the next step is to create a WordPress setup for this domain. So what you do is look for Fantastico Deluxe, click on that, click on the WordPress link over to the left and then click on New Installation. And then from the drop down you'll be able to find the domain you've added. So I'm doing yes to travel savings right now. And then enter a admin username but don't make it admin because that makes it easier for hackers. Put in a password, site name and description you can have but they'll get replaced anyway once you bring the clone back over. And then click on finish installation. And then information is displayed. You can send an email of the details to yourself, so enter an email address. And then that's that. Now we have to use an FTP program to copy the WP Twin Deploy file into the public HTML. Now I've switched over to adrienkeating.com 
You also need to copy the clone file. And now, because it's the first time I've used it on this domain, I have to validate, so I just entered the appropriate email. Uh, click on now you select up in the address bar wp-twin-deploy.php and then it brings this page up. Select from the drop down list number two, choose the clone file, and then you click on the next button and then it says sign site clone deployed and here we are site all copied over, all functioning. Now you can just log in with the previous details, wp-admin, and I'm in, and that's it. Hope you enjoyed the demonstration. I hope you found this video useful. As I mentioned during the demonstration, you don't have to be transferring a domain to use wp-twin, but it is for WordPress sites. It is a must-have tool for creating backups, you can even automate the process. Not long ago, I saw how important backups are. My daughter's blog was hacked. I was quickly able to recover the blog and then spend a few hours to beef up security. But that's for another video. If you value your content, whether it's a personal blog or for business, I say to you now, if you don't have backups in place, you are taking a risk. Go ahead now and purchase WP Twin. It's the best backup solution I've seen for WordPress. Just click the link below and enter your payment details and shortly you'll be able to have WP Twin in action to safeguard your information. If you need assistance, I'm happy to help. So once you purchase, I'll be in contact and ask if you've got any questions or need assistance. Thanks, this is Rob Keating. Thanks for watching.